Hi friends, my name is Raj and you are watching TechWide. So in this video, I will show you how to fix this startup repair error. Startup repair could not repair your PC if you are getting this error on your laptop or desktop. In this video, I will show you step by step troubleshooting method to fix this issue completely. There are few reasons. If your hard disk is corrupted or there is any hardware issue or your windows file is corrupted or missing or you recently install any new software or any new update then you will get this error to fix this error you have to open your laptop on advanced repair options there are two methods to open your laptop or desktop in advanced repair option i will show you both the steps so let's start with the first method to open your laptop in advanced repair options so turn on your pc or your laptop turn it on and wait for the windows logo then shut down your pc forcefully then turn it on again and wait for the windows logo and then again turn it off forcefully now turn off your laptop forcefully again then turn it on again and do the same you need to do this activity at least three time to open your laptop in advanced repair options turn it off again then turn it on now wait for the windows logo and you can see please wait now window is opening in advanced repair options need to wait for few seconds it will open in advanced repair options or you can say recovery option here you can see now we have to click on advanced repair option this is the option this is the first method let's move on to our method 2 so if you are able to log in on your laptop or desktop go to the search bar and type reset this pc click on it now go to advanced startup and click on restart now now wait for a few seconds it will open in advanced recovery option here you can see these are the options we needed so let's go to the troubleshoot option click on it then go to advanced option now go to system restore click on it it will restore your last a point last restore point so click on system restore now you can see your window will restart and prepare if you have any restore point wait for a few minute now choose your login name now enter your password if you have otherwise press on continue here you can see i don't have any restore point this is the error you can read it so we need to cancel this window and let's move on to our method 2 to fix this startup repair error go to troubleshoot then advance options then go to startup repair it will diagnose your pc and it will fix if you have any startup error wait for a few seconds it will diagnose your pc now you can see it is unable to repair your startup error so again go to the advance option go to troubleshoot go to advanced options again and now we have to choose command prompt 
now you have to type a command to repair or check your hard disk so the command is csk dsk space slash f space slash r then space c colon and press enter to run this command it will take around uh, 5 to 10 minutes so i will fast forward this video now you can see the process has been completed now now we have to enter another command to repair windows corrupted files type sfc space slash scan now this process also take 5 to 10 minutes so i will fast forward this video now type exit to exit cmd now you can check by press on continue if you are still facing the same issue then we need to reset this laptop so i will tell you how to reset your laptop go to troubleshoot then click on reset this pc it will reset your laptop click on it now you have two options keep your files or remove everything so i will choose keep my files with the help of this option keep my files your files your data will remain safe and your window will reinstall completely all your software will uninstall wait for few seconds now you can see you can read all three important points and your window will reinstall completely all your uh, software will be uninstalled only your data will remain safe so you can choose this option reset this pc and choose keep my files then click on reset so this process will take around half an hour or 40 minutes to complete so i will fast forward this video so it's reinstalled completely so these are the troubleshooting methods so thank you. Thanks for watching TechWide. Have a nice day.